This is the end of a tough year for many people, and sometimes we simply need cheering up. We head to Kart Sport in Auckland's Avondale. It's a go-kart track where two dogs, yes, the dogs, are preparing to drive solo for the first time anywhere in the world. I'm not entirely convinced the dogs have a clue what's going on, but this is a story that's travelled as far and wide as any other New Zealand story we can remember this year. It's been everywhere. Tristram Clayton, who first brought us the story a week ago, is there. Tristram D-Day. G'day, Charlie. Yes, welcome to West Auckland, where it really is D-Day. In a few moments, this dog, Monty, is going to attempt to become the first dog ever to drive a car down a racetrack. It's never been happened before, and it's going to be quite something to see if it comes off. But, you know, amazing to think that two months ago, this dog, Monty, was a homeless stray at the SPCA in South Auckland, just two months ago. And then some incredible campaign began that this dog and two others were trained to do, well, hopefully these, these feats. Here's a quick recap of how we got to this point. It's a giant snazzle cross. Oh my goodness, someone needs to adopt that dog. I can't see us only going over three for now. Yes, we need to be too young. But they're all good, I must say. There's not much between any of them. No animal's ever driven a car before, so what we're going to do is we're going to do it straight. We're going to uh, uh, head off, you know, so we start the car, um, get into position, brake on, gear in place, back onto the steering wheel accelerator, take off, and hoot along the straight and then stop. get a dog in a car, no trainer, get out of the car, and it does the whole gag itself. I tell you what, it's been a real challenge. That's right, because there's nobody in the car, is there? No one in the car, no tricks, it's all it's all Monty driving. So she's going. Yeah. And, and we, we saw you um, in the clip selecting the dogs from the SPCA, but are they some sort of super dogs? Are they specially intelligent? Oh, I wish they were, but uh, actually it turns out they are. So uh, what, what we actually got six dogs and chose three out of the six. All six could have done it, and... Uh, we're just blown away by how, how good they've been, and uh, yeah, the dogs in the SPCA are amazing, I must say. Well, Monty looks ready to go. All right, so tell us now, what, what's going to happen right now for a start? So it's a world first, and we're going to go 70 metres down this track, and, uh, and uh, he's going to put it in gear himself, uh, accelerate off, and uh, do the whole lot himself. So, uh, Great stuff. Well, fingers Marie. crossed, guys. I'll hand it over to you. And Marie. Hey, Marie. So, hey. Good boy. Here you are. Monty, get her! Yeah, good boy! Hey! Good boy, Monty! Good boy, wait! Good boy! Good boy, Monty, wait! Good boy! Good dog! So basically now he's got to put on the accelerator, his right foot on the accelerator. Wait! He's steering with his left hand. He's being... Paws, of course, right foot, left foot. Yep, yep, his left paws on the steering wheel. And basically... Good. In this position, he's uh, he's in the driving mode. Now, was there yeah. a little bit of braking in the back to accelerate? Right. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah he's, he thought he might go into his third gear, maybe, but... Uh, <laughs> Extraordinary sight, uh, isn't it? Look at this. Good, Good, boy. Good, Good boy. boy. Good boy. Clever boy. And uh, so now he's going to get to the finish line. Wait. And... Ready? Hey! Right. Oh, yeah, boy. Yeah. <laughs> 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 um, I love that 
Let's just stop at the end there. Exactly, exactly. Now, Mark, it's almost too bizarre to believe. Is that real? There's no remote control in it no, all right, somewhere? That's, that's all the dog doing it. He's, he's, he put, uh, basically started the key, uh, put, it, uh, put it, his paw on the brake to allow the car to go into gear, puts it into drive, back onto the uh, steering wheel, accelerator on, off he goes, down the track, and then gets over the finish line, brake on. Now, no one, no one understands animals better than you. Does he know what's going on? Well, actually, in the last little while, when we actually got into the car and started the, the whole gag out of the rig that you saw him train in, and got in the car and we started movement, he does, in fact, we, he's a bit of a hoon, this guy. Lucky we didn't have the exhibit on full. He can actually... That this morning he had Marie chasing the car down the road and he was off. Yeah, incredible. <laughs> so it was governed to a certain speed, was it? Yeah, to govern it for yeah. welfare reasons, but... Um, the, uh, the old knob uh, uh, came off this morning a little bit and he was down the road at about 30 kilometres an hour and we were chasing him. <laughs> Sensational. I, mean, I love seeing that. It's just, it gets me every time. An extraordinary look to see that dog just cruise along. Yeah, he looks like he's enjoying it. Oh, he loves it. He loves it. When you, when you get pick the rig in there, open the door, that guy was getting in my car the other day, he hopped in, he's sitting in the driver's seat. Come on, Monty, out of here. You're not the yeah, any problems? <laughs> Have you had any near mishaps? Well, we, had to, we, was, we were doing a little bit of um, rehearsal filming and stuff the other day. Cameron got, in the, Cameron got in the way of the car and uh, we nearly got a Cameron run over, but we managed to uh, save the day. Monty put the brakes on and saved him from... Uh, <laughs> no, I, I'm, sure, I'm, sure, I'm sure. thrilled to be able to say that that's not the end, is it? Now, you've got something, you've got another little uh, project up your sleeve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll come to you later in the program. Tell us what's the story. We're you in the car and take you for a ride down the bottom here and see what you can do. You want me in the car, you're he's going to drive around the corner. He's going to go around a 180 degree corner, all the camber, the whole bit, and... Uh, we're going to put uh, Porter in the car this time and uh, show you what uh, he that, can do. That sounds tough. So a different dog and on a corner is going to be tough. But um, on a is, it, is, it, is that safe? Uh, well, we'll see. I wouldn't <laughs> get in it. But <laughs> no, well, you'll be right. Don't worry. All right. Then. So there you have it, John. So ha hang around. Next up, we're going to have me in the car in the passenger seat taking that 180-degree corner at the end of the track. So 